Johnson. CJ. Oh, shit. Come on over here, son. Move over. Let him sit down, asshole. So you finally found time to drop by. Man, I've been busy. I've been burying my moms, man. Sounds like a fucking excuse to me. Officer Pulaski thinks you're trying to screw with us, Carl. Now you get this straight. We own you. You're ours. We can shit on you from such a height, you'll think God himself has crapped on you. You understand? He better fucking understand. Yeah, he better have. Time to go to work, CJ, and earn your freedom. There's a guy holed up across town. You got that address, Pulaski? Another gang-banging, drug-pushing, cop-killing bitch just like you. We don't like him, and he don't like us. Now, you make sure he never leaves the neighborhood, not even in a box. Now get the fuck out of here. All right, what's going on, everyone? Kazam Senza here, and this is Grand Theft Auto San Andreas. This is the mission called um, Burn of Desire, where uh, basically you will be going to uh, kill this dude in the house in this, uh, in this neighborhood. And then this is actually the first mission where you uh, where you meet your first girlfriend in the game. So uh, first, first, if you don't have a Molotovs, no, actually you should go and get the Molotovs. First, and then go to the gang's house, just so you could torture. Okay, so that's that's all you have to do. So, well, to me, um, before doing this mission, I did do the uh, the fire missions, the uh, the firefighter missions. So I was really um, <coughs> fireproof. That's the word. So I was fireproof. So. Yeah, so that's the advantage that I had, and there'll be some dude shooting at you, but for some reason I didn't retaliate. For some reason I just, I was just thinking, oh damn it, I'll just go. But uh, yeah, and then after I just realised, look at my health, damn it. And then that guy ran away. Come back here, there you go. <clears throat> uh, where is it? Alright, there's, there, there's a window there. Chuck it straight onto the glass, so it will just go right in. There you go. Oh, oh my god, look at my health. Oh jeez, look at my health. And then and then that's when I thought, no way, if I continue trying to torch those uh stuff, <coughs> there'll be no way. So I thought I'll go to the nearby chicken shop and then just you know eat, get my health back, and then come back here with full health. And then now I can rip these dudes apart. Oh my god, I missed it. You see look, I caught myself on fire, and that is the odds. You can catch yourself on fire, so but because I've done the firefighter missions, so uh, I'm like pretty easy. I mean, because um, yeah, because I'm totally immune from the fire, so I won't burn at all. Okay, so there's one more window here, and then off we go. See, look, I'm on fire again. Alright, so there you go. I mean, you trap to go inside. So just go into the house. There'll be no enemy in here, so that's fine. Uh, my advice is, if you do go to the kitchen like I have, use uh, get the fire extinguisher, otherwise you have to come back down. But when I was doing this mission, I actually didn't get the uh, <coughs> fire, fire extinguisher. So I've got to make two trips, you know. So I'll just look around the house, see where the, uh, which, where the stairs are, because it's upstairs. Then I finally found it here. <clears throat> and then let's just go. You there? You okay? Yeah, but those flames! They're too hot! I'm scared! Hold on, it's probably a fire extinguisher in the kitchen. I'll be right back. Alright, now you see what I mean? If if I picked up the fire extinguisher, I would have saved a journey going downstairs, but because I did it. So I've got to do it the hard way. Well, not really the hard way, just the long way, really. Uh, pick it up. Go. And, and what did I replace? I think I replaced the camera. I'll turn it on, man. Just get it again. <coughs> now let's just blow this down. 
Stand back! Put it out! Put it out! Do, 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 do. Nice. Oh god, I'm so scared! Oh my god, what was that? Hey, the building's starting to collapse. We gotta get out of here fast! Alright, now you see the building collapsed with blocks past, so you just have to, uh. Shit. You have Shit. to take no, these fire extinguisher out. Yeah, you, you just have to take out those flames. I mean, whether or not you're fireproof or anything, you have to take it out just for, uh, just for the girl. The floor <clears throat> Otherwise, she'll be trapped and everything, so. But then what? I mean, really, you can just take your time, because there's no time limit uh, in order to get out. So, so that's, that's the upside already, so. Just take her out, just make sure she's right behind you. No, not this way. That way out. Try and try to find out like, different ways. See, it's blocked. Blocked again. Has to go through this room. And then there you go. There's a there's the exit. Where is she? Can't get it. All right. Good stuff. Hey man, I owe you my life. I was nearly dead there for sure. <laughs> hey, you look pretty shook up, girl. You want me to take you home? Yeah, please, thanks. Alright, there you go. So you went into the house. You, you rescued the girl. No shit. And now you're just gonna take And now you're just gonna take her home. To live dangerously. You're CJ, right? Yeah, how you know me? Everybody in the grove knows you and your brother. Well, I thought you'd run away. I never ran away, okay? I just needed to get away from shit. Alright, there you go. So, a house is this just is here. My place here. Hey, what's your name? Denise. Denise Robinson. Give me a call sometime. We should go out or something. Yeah, I'd like that. Okay, I'll catch you later, CJ. Alright, there you go. That's your first girlfriend of the game. And uh, if you want, you can step into Marco to uh, take her out. I'm Kazam Sensei, hope you guys enjoyed this, I hope you guys like this video, I'm out, peace.